Acharya Sutara Sutta Sri Srimad His Divine Grace A.C. Bhakti Vedanta Goswami Maharaj Srila Prabhupada Ki Jai Srila Prabhupada Ki Jai His Divine Grace Srila Prabhupada Ki Jai Ananta Koti Vaishnava Vrinda Ki Jai Nama Charja Srila Haridas Thakur Ki Jai Prem Chikaho Shri Krishna Chaitanya Pampunita Ananda Shri Abhita Gadadhar Shri Vasari Gaur Bhakti Vrinda Ki Jai Shri Shri Radha Radha Krishna Gopa Gopi Nashai Makun Radha Kun Giri Gobert Han Ki Jai Shri Vrindavan Dham Ki Jai Shri Mayapur Navadweet Dham Ki Jai Shri Jagannath Puri Dham Ki Jai Jagannath Ratha Yatra Mahod Sava Ki Jai Baladev Subhadra Ki Jai Ganga Maya Ki Jai Jalangi Maya Ki Jai Jamuna Maya Ki Jai Bhakti Devi Ki Jai Tulsi Maharani Ki Jai Go and pray my name Hey Go! All glories to the assembled devotees Hey Krishna All glories to the assembled devotees Hey Krishna All glories to the assembled devotees Hey Krishna All glories, all glories to Shri Guru Shri Shri Guru and Go Ranga All glories to Ranga Huh. Always nice to have a kirtan, and that was a really sweet one. So, what are we going to talk about today? <laughs> oh, there's so many things. This last week, I've been working on the Vedanta Sutra, as usual. And uh, the section I'm working on deals with two, uh, or has dealt with two different kinds of philosophy. The first is the Sankhya philosophy, which has two parts. The first is that matter itself creates the universe by itself. And the other part, which is called Vaisheshika, is that the world is created by atoms. Does this sound familiar? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You all learned it in school. It's called science. <laughs> uh, uh, there are rascals. <laughs> so these ideas aren't modern by any means. They call it modern science. Uh, and they try to say that, oh yes, we have the greatest knowledge and the, and the best ideas and the most advanced technology. And see, we've been improving now for thousands of years and now our theories are much better. <laughs> but this same theory was refuted quite thoroughly in Vedanta Sutra over 5,000 years ago. Uh, the idea that matter somehow or other <laughs> by itself can create the whole universe is at the root of the whole scientific conception of the world. See, there's this matter, and somehow it goes kablooey, and there's this <laughs> big bang, and then all this stuff happens simply by chance, which results in, voila, the material universe. Paper <laughs> tennis, ice pops. <laughs> <laughs> well, even if you, even with ice pops, you have a mold. <laughs> huh? These these scientists are trying to say that the matter just, you know, as if the ice just naturally forms itself into an ice pop, which is crazy. We don't ever find that something comes from nothing. In fact, we find that the more complex and the more powerful any construction is, the more intelligence it requires to create it. Uh -huh. Take, for example, a car or, or any kind of machine, a computer or whatever. 